Alice LPS. Hi guys, and today we have a LPS review. So if you're an avid watcher of the Alice LPS YouTube channel, um, you'll know that I review a lot of LPS lovers QA's LPS. Well, she's been popping off recently and making a ton of really cool designs and she sent over her two recent ones for me to review. If you're not familiar with LPS Lover QA, um, she creates custom LPS designs on fake LPS. Like, they're, they're professionally factory printed, so they look pretty authentic, but without that authentic price tag, you know what I mean? So, they're a really good option for people that are wanting to collect LPS that can't afford the expensive Savannah Reed, I, I guess. <laughs> And they're all completely unique designs which are usually designed by fans on her Instagram. So if you want to follow her and submit any designs sometime, go check out her Instagram feed. Um, so these two designs are actually designed by two Warrior Cats fans. So I I'm personally not very familiar with the Warrior Cats series. Um, so please bear in mind with my uh, noob noobness. Do people say noob in 2020? What would you say? Rusty? Am I, I... I just don't know much about warrior cats. My knowledge of warrior cats just stems from Pink Bunny Girls series. That, that's all I know about warrior cats. Um, but I'm pretty sure these are uh, custom designs. If I'm wrong, don't yell at me. Please tell me kindly. <laughs> Inform the children. Um, yeah, let's just have a look! So first up, of course, we have our little accessory bag. I'm kind of hyped for this one. I think they come um, with random accessories every time, so it's always like you're getting a little extra blind bag. Whoa, okay, there's more than I thought was in here, okay. Oh, I have a little thank you written on it. Thank you! So we have a little... Ooh. So first we have an LPS food bowl. I'm pretty sure these are remolded from authentic LPS things, so they're, they're very similar. To like getting LPS from the box like back in the old days so it looks like they're crunchy on cereal maybe berries I don't know then we have these two these are my fave they're both the same shape um, but one's a really nice yellow color it would suit my mascot right now actually these both would suit my mascot because I got blue eyes so here's the yellow one I'm still not sure whether it's a skirt or a shirt but it can be whatever I guess but yeah, and there are this really great, um, kind of rubbery, poly pocket feeling fab fabric, it's not fa like plastic. Um, <laughs> so you can fit it on a ton of different LPS sizes. I think the blue one's cuter. I'll keep that on. I don't know if it's a skirt, but I'm rocking it as a skirt right now. Oh, I think these are some little earrings. So in here we have two pearls and two diamonds. And in this one we have two different coloured diamonds, there's a blue one and a hot pink, but I'm going to leave those in here so I won't lose them and I can use them another time because I've already got a flower in my hair. Thank you for the little accessories, I always love opening them and seeing what I get. But I guess now it's time for the, for the big reveal. What are these little warriors? I'll start with this one because it was the, the one that was announced first. You guys might be more aware with this design if you follow her on Instagram because of course she posts them before she sends them out, you know what I mean? Oh, is she not coming out? Whoa! Okay, da 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 da, it's a grey cat! So on her announcement Instagram post for this design, she said that it's a warrior cat called J Feather designed by warrior cats underscore confessions. So I'm assuming the name's J Feather. If I'm wrong, please don't shout at me. I don't, I'm not familiar with Warrior Cats and it might just be an original design, I'm assuming. Um, yeah. Cool. I really like this color for the, for the base. It's not a plain gray, it's like a brownish gray. So it definitely gives me that kind of wild cat vibe. I guess I'll start from head to toe. So on the top, there are these little like wild cat looking markings, kind of like a, a tabby cat, I guess. Um, she has these really pretty hot pink ears. On the muzzle there's a marking that goes up and the same colour on the eyelids and a pretty pink nose. On her cheeks and on the back here are the same little dark markings, kind of like whiskers, but I guess, mm, I don't know. A little marking on her front here and her paws and her tummy. Oh, I like the tummy marking, that's a nice touch. And then the tail, oh the back as well. There's a lot of markings going on with this design, I like it. 
But I think the most noticeable thing with her is the eyes. They're very bright. They're, they're a really unique design. Comparing her to my mascot right here, you can tell that instead of using a black in the eyes, they used a dark blue, which I think is really unique. There's also a, a dark black eyeliner line, I think. So there's four shades of blue in the eyes there, and then a little star marking as a highlight. It kind of reminds me of like the the messiest pair, the oh, what are they called? They were like the insert word ist pet and they would all have a, a little design in their eye. That, I really liked that gimmick. It was really cool but it reminds me of that. Like she's the coolest pet. Did the coolest ones have stars? I can't remember. But yeah, has little stars in the eyes and then a main little circle highlight there. Really cool. I love this. This is cute. Yes, cool. And then we have 0333, Agent 0333. <laughs> no, I think that's just her her number. This one didn't have a number. I, I guess we only have one secret agent in the house. I'm just joking by the way. I don't know if you can tell. I have a really intense sense of humour. Okay, this one is orange! So on the Instagram post she says, New arrival, Firestar, the short-haired cat designed by atwolves42. I think that's a very fitting name for an orange cat. She, she looks very fiery, very feisty, but also very adorable. I, I, I think I'm already, oh I don't know. I'll compare the two at, at the end of the video, but yes. I like this design a lot. I'll start from top to tail again. Has these kind of like reddish foxy colored ears. It kind of reminds me of a, a fox cat. This one's kind of like a wolf cat, but that one's like a, a fox cat. <laughs> Um, and on the inside of the ears there's this pretty cream colour which is kind of running throughout the whole design which I really like. And on the middle of her forehead here there's kind of like a... I don't know how you describe it but there were some orange cats that Hasbro made with little patterns like that. Not exactly the same but very similar and it gives me that nostalgia, I love it. And then these little like eyebrow dots, oh so cute. She has a little knocking on the side, um, yeah that's, that's her head. Down the front here of her body, more cream colour, some little markings on the back you can't really see because she has a big head, um, but there's some red here. She has a cream front paws and her belly is plain, but her tail isn't. Look at that. Whoa, she's pretty cool. Quite fiery indeed. Let's compare the two. Fighting out, warrior cat style. <laughs> hmm, I like, I like both of them. I like this whole sort of eyeshadowy design on this one, but I think I prefer the eyes of this one. Oh, I didn't, I didn't show you the eyes. Look at those eyes. She has a star in the top highlight rather than the bottom one, but her eyes are just a solid green, I think. I'm not too sure. I think I prefer the eyes of this one because I like green eyes and I I think I do prefer the, the black colours because then it's more cohesive with Hasbro's LPS. So say if you were like using them in a series together, they will look like they're from the same universe rather than... I don't know, this one's still cute and I think it would still work well in LPS videos but it's a little bit like, whoa. They're both really cool in their own way. I can imagine them being like Howls in, in the woods, in the forest, foraging, getting them berries and stuff, all that warrior cat goodness. I don't really know what warrior cats do, but feel free to roast me in the comments. But yeah, that's the, the new pets. Um, LPS Lover QA has actually announced some other pets recently. There is a collie with an ear up. But yeah, that's also out. Um, it's a really different mold for 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 collies. The only collie molds we have is the pour down collie and then the one pour up sage so it's really cool to have some variants in the fake LPS community. Um, so yeah that's out and she's also coming out with some new spaniels at the moment so if you would like me to review those spaniels be sure to show this video some love by giving it a like and letting me know what you think in the comments down below and then maybe I can share with you the spaniel thoughts so yeah I'm gonna wrap this video up here let me know who your favorite is in the comments down below is the orange cat or the gray cat um, I think I'm leaning towards this the gray I they're both really cute. I, I don't really know 
let me know what you think um but yeah cool cool beans um i'll see you guys next time next week with a new video don't forget to comment like subscribe and i'll see you guys next time